Hey, what's up, y'all? In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to install um, Yellow Dog Linux on your PlayStation 3. Um, there are other videos out there um, showing you how to do this. If you guys watch my videos, watch this, right? Why not? It's by the same guy. Um, Alright, first off, what you're going to have to do is you're going to have to format your hard drive. Um, for the PlayStation, it gives you two options. One's a full format, the other one's a quick format. What you're going to want to do is you're going to want to do the full format. If yours is a 60 gig, the full format's going to take about two hours. So you got you got lots of time, right? So this is why I'm telling you, you're going to format it first. While it's formatting, I'm going to have you do other stuff. Or I'm going to show you how to do other stuff, right? So uh, to format your hard drive, what you do is you go into settings. Go down until you see system settings. Click X. Um, go down until you see format utility. Click X. Format hard drive. And then you would click yes. In my case, um, I'm not doing it to my PlayStation. I'm actually doing it for my buddy's PlayStation over here. Um, it's actually already running. Um, the install process has started already. Um, let me get you up to the speed. Uh, what you do is you then click yes here. Uh, it'll ask you if you want to uh, format it so that all your hard drive space goes to your PlayStation or do you want custom. What you want to do is you want to click custom and then in my case I put 10 gigabytes to the PlayStation unit and the rest um, to the other operating system. Uh, there are other options. Um, you'll see it when you go and try. And then once that, once you choose that, it'll ask you if you want to do a quick install or a full install. Um, do the full install. It's going to take about two hours if you have the 60 gig. If you have the 20 gig, it'll take about an hour. The 80 gig, it'll take about what, two and a half hours or three, something like that. Um, right, and so on. Uh, so what you're going to do is you're going to do a full a full sorry a full format um, all right once you're done once you're done the f once you started the format sorry once you started the format um, you're gonna go and all right once you started the format you have about two hours to kill right so what you're gonna do is you're gonna download um, Yellow Dog Linux on your place on your onto your computer. All right, uh, let me show you how to do this. All right, what you're then gonna do is you're then gonna go to Google, um, type in Yellow Dog Linux. It'll bring you to this. Click on the first one. It'll bring you to the TetraSoft Solutions webpage. Um, you then go to uh, Support and click Downloads. Um, this is where you can download Yellow Dog Linux for free. Um, you go down to the mirrors and then you click on one of the mirrors uh, try the first one bingo you click on ISO ISO is uh, the format that you can burn an image on a disk so you go ISO you go all the way to the bottom as you can see the last one um, here is 5.0.2 I'm actually I've actually downloaded 5.0.1 um, because it says here it's for the PS3 I know this one will work too, but this one's the one that finished first, so I'm just going to use this. Um, as you can see here, it's also a large file, so you know it's all there. Um, so what you do is you then click. I'm going to do this one because I'm going to try this out as well. Um, you click on it. It'll ask you to open it or save it. I'm going to save it uh, to my download section here. Click save, and then as you can see here, this takes your two hours. Um, well, at least in my case, it depends on your internet connection. Um, so, when this is done, uh, that means the formatting is going to be done too. So, um, that works out for me. Uh, no lost time, right? So, what you then do is wait for that to download. And while it's downloading, uh, you twiddle your thumbs because there's nothing much you can do. You could you could watch my YouTube videos. That's what you're gonna do. You're gonna go on YouTube. Up YouTube. Go in here. 
go to youtube.com click enter oh my god I spelled it wrong youtube.com go to here go ps3 support s u p p o r t and then you're gonna watch my videos just to pass the time and cuz you just wanna know what's up right um... <laughs> alright um... alright now once that is finished downloading what you're gonna do is you're then gonna burn the image onto a dvd um... what you do is you then open your dvd software actually you know what i'm gonna open um... the file that I saved it to. I mean, the folder that I saved it to. I saved mine to downloads. Um, as you can see, it's right there. You then right click on it, send to. I use Record Now to burn my uh, images. Um, another program you could use is, let's see what it's called, Copy to DVD. That also works good. Um, but I'm not going to use that because it's a trial. So quit my full copy of record now works great so I'll just use that once it's then where there it'll say uh, choose a location for the image it's already put in there what you do is you then put a DVD in your burner and click burn um, you could also do this if you don't have a DVD burner um, using five I mean sorry six CDs um, if you want to learn how to do this, you could send me a message. But let me tell you right now, um, the last time I tried to do it with six uh, CDs, one of those files uh, turned out corrupted. So I uh, sent an email to Tetrasoft and I said, don't do it this way, do the DVD way. So this is what I'm showing you, how to do it with the DVD. Um, once it's burnt onto a DVD, what you're gonna do is you're gonna insert it into your PlayStation. All right. Once you put your um, newly made image, the DVD, um, into the PlayStation, what you do is you then go to once again settings, system settings. You go down to install other operating system. Click OK. Um, Right now it says there's no partitioning because uh, I didn't do the I didn't do the partition I didn't do the uh, format so I'm just gonna tell you what to do. Um, it'll say install other OS. If it reads it, it'll say start. You click on start. It'll download for a little bit. Then say it'll tell you to go up to system sorry default system and then change it to other operating system. This will make your PlayStation 3 restart and start the install process. Um, once the install process starts, let me just change the channel, show you what it looks like.